Our last three days were spent at the Tangulia Mara camp in the Maasai Mara uh, sanctuary area. The camp was run by a gentleman by the name of Jackson Lucea, who is quite well known for his uh, work with lions and has been on PBS specials quite a lot. This next picture is a water buck. Not uncommon, but uh, also not unbeautiful. We saw hippos, a lot of hippos, in the lake that was just outside our window at the camp. And this is one with his mouth open. Our guides were Benjamin and Bonicia, both lovely people. And this is a spotted hyena. We saw many of them, but they are, again, not nearly as fierce or ugly as they are portrayed in movies. And then there was the lion pride. This was uh, a special treat. Uh, Jackson Luceo went, came with us as a personal accompaniment to the uh, day we went out to see the lions. You can see the little cub there. They were beautiful, just beautiful in the morning sunshine. Uh, we saw them a number of times, this same pride. They are following them uh, with a British uh, PBS crew. And then we saw a leopard. This was a rare occasion, and they, our guy got very excited and drove to, across the countryside at a huge speed, scared the dickens out of us, uh, to be there to catch sight of this leopard because he heard from other guides that, that uh, they had also spotted a leopard. He was beautiful and much bigger than a cheetah, which you'll see in just a minute because we saw one right after we saw the leopard. But uh, the leopard is much heavier, much more muscled than the cheetah is. Uh, although it was hard when I was looking at the pictures to tell the difference, except when I got close I realized how much bigger the leopard is than the, che than the cheetah. Look how beautifully he moves. He was just gorgeous. Or she. <laughs> Here's the cheetah. Um, and once you get close, you can see that the head shape is a little different, the ear shape is a little different, although they're both spotty. Uh, they are just both beautiful big cats. It's so cool seeing him in the wild like that. See his head is a little smaller. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the cheetah. And the leopard. You see how thick the le leopard's neck is in comparison to the cheetah. His body is longer and more muscled and the spots are a little different. Then we had our big exciting moment with the village Maasai people. Uh, they sang to us, and I'll let you listen. This was our last big thrill in our trip to Kenya and was the highlight of the whole trip. These people were so beautiful and so glad to see us because they had not had visitors much during the COVID issues. So they were very, very happy to see us and wonderfully gracious. I'll leave links to the three camps we stayed at, as well as for the Reteti uh, 
sanctuary for the elephants. And uh, I'll link to some information about Jackson Lucea and the, his uh, work with lions. He's just a really interesting, knowledgeable person. Just I was blown away by him. That was our trip.